Yeah, move on. Yeah. Yeah, I came in with a saw. What's up, YouTube? This your boy G Baby. I am back here with another video. Golly, man, it's been but four days, man. Back, I'm better. And that's all that matters. But you click this video for a reason. You want to know how to survive your freshman year of college. You know what I'm saying? I haven't went through like my whole freshman year, but I've been summer school. I'm in summer school right now. I stayed on campus. I've seen it all. And I'm going to tell you, I'm about to give you these steps. I'm about to just be your counselor to help you survive your freshman year. Because high school, high school was baby steps. There was baby steps. You're in college now. It's getting, it gets better. <laughs> it gets a whole lot better. Way better. Phenomenal. So give the video a thumbs up right now. If you do subscribe to the channel, click the subscribe button. Matter of fact, if you minimize this and click the red button right now, I'm going to be right here waiting for you. I know I know you clicked it, but I'm waiting for the other one to click the subscribe button. Alright, first thing you need to know about college, the first thing you need to know is that you will have a lot of freedom. You're going to have a lot of freedom, man. You're going to have the freedom to do anything you want. Right now, I have nothing to do right now on my laptop, on Netflix, watching TV, making a video, or, you know what I'm saying? I could do anything I want. You have as much freedom as you can, but don't miss your classes. You know what I'm saying? Don't try to miss your classes. You're going to miss some classes. You're going to run into some bumps, but make sure you make all your classes and stuff like that. But you have a lot of freedom, man. That's the first step. And make sure you maintain your time because look, you're going to have all the time and all the time in the world to do anything you want, but there's going to be times you're going to be lazy. You're going to be doing this and you need to get this done and that done and then you're messed up if you understand what I'm saying. Now, Second step, protection. <laughs> this is key, man. This is a major freaking key. Okay? I'm not trying to get monetized, but as a condom, man, be protected, man. They got a lot of nasty stuff around you, man. That's major key. There's nothing else I can say about that. That is a major key. Like, please make sure you're strapped up. Make sure you're strapped up, man. Just like you put your case on your phone. Yeah, that's for all my fellas. Third step, man. Third step, man. Make sure you have a Snapchat. Make sure you have a Snapchat. I know everybody that's in college right now should have a Snapchat. If you don't, you lame as shit and you need to get on. You got a Snapchat, man. Make sure you get a Snapchat. Because say if you, say if you, this goes for girls and guys, say if you see a her or you see a him, you want to talk to her, don't give them your phone number. You know what I'm saying? Because most likely, if you give her your phone number, y'all gonna text, y'all gonna fall off now. He got your number, he got your number, she got your number. You, you don't want your number spread around. You don't want your name spread around at all. So make sure you get that person's Snapchat. Make your Snapchats interesting so that other person could comment on there. And boom, you're on to any girl, any guy. Make sure y'all get Snapchat. Snapchat is key. It's very key. It's a, it's a major key. It's a major key. Fourth step. Make sure you get out your room. Don't stay in your room. I know a lot of people that just stay in their room and don't do nothing. Get out, explore. If you if you stay in your room all day, you're not gonna get any girls. You're not gonna get any guys. You're not gonna do nothing. You're gonna be lonely. You're not gonna go to parties. You're not gonna fit in. You want everybody to know you in college. You don't want to be just a regular student. You want everybody to know your name. You want that girl on the second floor, especially to know your name. And your penis. Fifth step in college. This will go this goes for all the males, you know what I'm saying? It goes for females too. You know what I'm saying? Females could agree, but males, you're not a freshman. When you're in college, you're not a freshman. When the girl asks you if you're a freshman, you're not a freshman. Sophomore up. If you, you know what I'm saying, if you got a little mustache, you know I'm saying you got, you know, them beards on the weather. Y'all get mine's don't even grow, but if you got a beard, you could easily pass by a senior or a junior, but you're never a freshman. Girls don't like freshmen. Girls like older dudes for some reason. You know what I'm saying? That's why they'll get cheated on. No shit. But make sure you always, always, always say nothing. Don't even, I don't want the girl to even think that you're a freshman. Your mindset got to be soft, girl, up. And you got to tell them that you're soft, girl, up. Girls, you can be wherever the fuck y'all want. We don't really care. Sixth step, man. 
make sure you dress well. Make sure you dress well. Make sure you make sure you you look decent. You know what I'm saying? I I can't even tell you. I see a lot of people walk out their room looking terrible, man. You don't want to look terrible. Girls don't want to talk to you when you look terrible. You know you're not gonna fit in when you're looking terrible. I say fit in a lot, cause fit in. You know, once you fit in with a bunch of people, they can help you in many ways in college, man. In many ways, I'm telling you. But you never want to dress up. You never want to come out raggedy, man. I'm telling you. Make sure you come in. You know, it don't even have to be much. It could be regular. You know, what I'm saying shorts and the shirt. Just make sure it matches. Make sure you got a little shoes. I'm saying little slippers. Make sure your hair always dead because girls like it. That's why. That's my only reason why. That's what it's all about. Seven step. That really nobody really cares about is make sure you go to class. Make sure you go to class. Make sure you any if you I play football, so make sure you go to your meetings. Make sure you do all that. Make sure you get all that done, man. Time is valuable, man. Time is valuable. You gonna have a whole lot of freedom. Like right now, I'm recording. You know what I'm saying? Like I've been done with class hours ago. You know what I'm saying? Hours ago. So make sure you maintain your time. Make sure you have enough time to get everything you, that's important done first. Then after it, you're gonna be cool. You do anything you want. The last final thing, which is the eighth thing, is that make sure you learn how to spend your money. Don't spend too much money because there's none like when your friends wanna go out and you're broke. It happens to all of us. It happens a lot, man. It happens to me. You never want to go out and you're broke, and you always want to have money on you. Don't spend your money on nothing stupid. Eat your popcorn, eat your ramen noodles. Don't go out, go out. Like we got Jack in the Box, spend money on Jack in the Box. We got Chick Fil A. Don't spend your money on Chick Fil A. Can your ugly ass to the calf? You know I'm saying. And eat for free. Don't spend your money on dumb stuff. You know what I'm saying. Don't spend your money on two hundred dollar pair of shoes when you get some Vans that's clean as elf. That you can wear anywhere, everybody wear it, very popular. So that's it. That's it for the video, man. Ah, who keeps on my phone? That's it for the video, man. If you enjoyed the video, give it a real thumbs up. And if you're new, subscribe to the channel, man. Camera, I'm looking at you. It's one on one talking about. Subscribe to my channel. I'm always I'm almost close to 1k man. I'm at 570 right now. I really would appreciate it. Click the subscribe button, man. And stop looking at me like I'm crazy, man. I work extremely hard, man. I deserve more than 500 subs. Click the subscribe button. Please. I'm out. Peace. Yeah.